Coming okay. straight out of the nocturnal jungle, uh, Rave Cave, also known as our, lo our lobby elevator, Bijou. Welcome. Yo, yo, what up? What up? How are you? How's it going? Welcome. Thanks for coming through. Thank you for having Masked me. Masked up, gloved up, perfect. Yes, sir. How's All it been right. going? How's your quarantine been? It's good. Been chilling. You good, know? good. Staying at home like everybody else should. Yep. So, you know? on my notes here, I do like these notes actually, um, even though they're not going to keep me in line from, in, um, line from talking. Um, I they do give me some facts here that I didn't know about you. That okay. Um, you, I heard you went to the uh, to the first nocturnal wonderland in Texas. I did. Back in 2010. What was that like? For, is that true? Yeah, that's true. Rockdale, Texas. It was uh, my first festival ever. That was, oh, I didn't know that part. Yeah. That's sick. First festival I, ever, yeah, Rockdale. I love, I love that because for you to be making music and your first festival being one, you know, one of ours, that's, I love that. How, how was the, that for you, the festival? It was cool. It was like, it, was, it had that old school rave feel. You know, you had 40,000 people out there in the middle of nowhere in Texas. Yeah. It's a different vibe, you know, and it was something special. And I went to the one in 2011, the next April as well. So I got to go two times in a row. Oh, nice. Which is amazing. And for those who are listening, I know I always get asked when events are mentioned, especially in Texas, why don't we bring it back? Why don't we bring EDC back to Texas, Nocturne back to Texas? It's been rough for us. Like, the reason why we didn't come back to that venue... I love the venue. I love the festival. It was magical. It was a full-on camp out. But the, the local uh, officers who, uh, you know, uh, they were pulling over every single headliner that was on the way to the festival. Do you remember really? that? Yeah, everybody got pulled over. Everyone got it pulled over. And it was like, I can't keep subjecting people to this. Yeah. Like, this is too hard, you know? We can't invite people to this amazing experience. We put all our heart and soul into it. It's going to be magical. It's going to be life-changing you're going to get pulled over and harassed on the way in, yeah. you know? So it was a little rough. Yeah, that's always fun. So we, we pulled out and we said, you know, although it was successful, we couldn't subject, I love you guys all so much. And when something's successful for us, doesn't mean it's good for you, you and we're not going to keep doing it. So that's, that's that story. But um, what do you have planned for your set tonight? Are you bringing some old school into this? Or are you just straight new? What's old school. Up? I got some old school, uh, nice. more old school West Coast G-House vibes. Kind of pay homage to the original like West Coast hip hop that I grew up on. Oh, nice. You know, so we're going to take it back a little bit. Oh, uh, yeah. We got some, we have some questions from some headliners. Okay. One of those questions is from at Sydney, Sydney Ann. And she wants to know, I shouldn't say she, I don't know if it's a she or he. <laughs> Sydney Ann wants to know, What's the funniest or weirdest thing a fan has ever given you? Oh, wow. So actually one time, I used to do this thing on my Snapchat story called So Dreamy when it had like the flower crown thing. And I was actually attending EDC one year before I actually played. And someone hit me up and was like, hey, meet me at the Neon Garden. I have something for you. And they actually brought me um, a beaded flower crown that said So Dreamy on it. It was just you random. You look so pretty. Why didn't you wear that tonight? You look so pretty with that on. <laughs> That would have been hard. I forgot you it, man. wore that. <laughs> All right, let's get right into it, you guys. Bijou. Yeah, yeah. Nocturnal Wonderland, Virtual Raveathon. Let's get into it. Let's do this.
Trying to consume some skirts for the E So I could get some phones rolling in my ride Chilling all alone Just hit the east side of the LBC On a mission trying to find Mr. Warren G Seen a car full of girls, ain't no need to tweak All of you hoes know what's up with 213 So I hit select on 21 and Lewis Some niggas shooting dice, so I said let's do this I jumped off the block and said what's up Some niggas put some gats, so I said I'm fine Since these hoes with me, I'm glad this word These bitches looking so hard, they straight hit the curb Now they dropping and yelling, it's a tad bit late Nate Dogg and Warren G had to regulate I'm getting jacked, I'm breaking myself I can't believe they taking women's wealth, they took my rings, they took my road mats. I looked up and never said, damn, what's next? They got my homie hemmed up and they all around. They know they see them if they go my straight path for path. Now they dropping and yelling, it's a tad bit late. Yeah. We are 
from the street somebody party 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 Damn, motherfuckers, like that. You like the way my back move, make it move to the house groove. You like the way my back move, make it move to the house groove. You like the way my back move, make it move to the house groove. You like the way my back move, make it move to the house groove. You like the way my back move, make it move to the house groove. You like the way my back move, make it move to the house groove. You like the way my back move, make it move to the house groove. You like the way my back move, make it move to the house groove. You like the way my back. 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 Make it move to the house.
how I come through with the one two kicking shit like kung fu. Let me tell you how I come through with the one two kicking shit like kung fu. Let me tell you how I come through with the one two kicking shit like kung fu. Let me tell you how I come through with the one two kicking shit like kung fu. Let me tell you, you. Let me tell you. Let me tell you, you. Let me tell you. Let me tell you, you. Let me tell you. Let me tell you, you. Let me tell you. Tell you how I come through with the one two kicking shit like Kung Fu. Pull up on me, I'm a mess, ay. Pull up on me, pull up on me, I'm a mess. 
Bijou, Nocturnal, Virtual Ravathon. Thanks so much for being here. Thank you for having me. That was, that was a fun one. Thank you. That was good. Appreciate it. Yeah, yeah. We have a, please stop by the gifting suite. We have a grab bag for you. Thank you very much. Appreciate sick, it. Shout out. Thank you, guys. Have a good rest of your quarantine. Disinfecto. We need you. Before we get into the next mix. Yeah. So, you guys, thanks so much for tuning in from across the globe.